20,000. It looks like that's the only thing. And by the way, I did just win the Malibu for a sweet price. Sweet, sweet, sweet price. We hustle daily. What's going on, Hustle Nation? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Big Play Ray, coming to y'all with another video today. In today's video, man, um, I'm kind of irritated in today's video. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I got some paperwork issues going on with a car that I got that don't got nothing to do with me. Got something to do with the pre previous owner, and I couldn't sell the car, so it's kind of pissing me off. Y'all probably seen that video already, or I probably sold it already, but I don't know if it's gonna be in order. But I'm just a little irritated in this video because I got a car can't do nothing with money stuck into the car until they figure this shit out um but anyway make sure y'all like comment subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell join the hustle nation if you haven't done so already if you want to follow me on instagram and tiktok make you make sure you look in the link in the description below got both links for you my instagram and my tiktok and um make sure you go to whdacademy.com if you're interested in learning how to buy and sell cars properly inspect cars check out the testimonials on the website i don't help hundreds of other people learn how to properly inspect cars and check out cars man so we got another escalade over here we about to check it out oh and make sure you copy your merch man we hustle daily.com you know what i'm saying support the campaign help your boy maintain so we got an escalade right here about to check this out and um yeah man let's get right into it y'all all right speaking of escalade we got another one right here 2002 this one is good tires got some little wheels on it Looks decent. Looks decent, looks decent, looks decent. So y'all all around the truck. Last Escalade roll good. This one is actually cleaner than the last one. Yeah, this one actually cleaner than the last one, guys. <coughs> uh -oh. See, moving by itself must be memory. All right, we got some squeaking going on. Going on. Oh wow. I see what's going on with this truck already. I didn't even notice that. And just that big old 6-0 right here. Yeah. That big 6-0, that ain't that 5-3 like the one I just. I don't want to say it's raggedy, but I see something on it that I don't like. And I don't want to tell y'all because y'all need to go to whdacademy.com. So what we're going to do is we're going to move to the next car. That's what we're going to do. Simple and plain. We need to waste no time, guys. Now, my, my uh, people, they, he want this, uh, this, this, uh, what's this thing called? Tours. He like this Taurus, but this Taurus got 260 on the mile, so I don't know if he's going to be interested in it. Oh, and by the way, I might be winning the uh, the, the Malibu 2013 Malibu today. We got to see. It's coming up. So I'll probably tell y'all in that tell y'all that in today's video. But we got that look good on that side. We got a 2013 um Ford Taurus. A little something going on here. Not that bad, though. Other than that, look good to me. Look good to me. Let's see what's going on in the inside. We got that leather. We got them raw papers. Ooh, it sounds good to have 260 on the mile, so I gotta check it just like the, got the raw papers they were smoking on that goo in the hood. You know what I'm saying? So, kind of just interested in seeing what this check engine light is on already. 
260 on the miles, bruh. What y'all think about that? 260,000. 260,000. Let's see what this light on for. Six codes. I ain't gonna lie to you, the codes are not horrible though. It's pretty much all the same code. Hold on, okay. Let's turn that down. Put this thing in here. Now 260, y'all think I can get this one cheap with a 260? Yeah, He gonna want it with 260 on it though. Well, he probably definitely not gonna want it because it got uh, check engine light codes on it. Damn. So this. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Damn it. Messed up. All right. So did I pop this in? Let's see what we got in here, man. This messed that Escalade over there. And this is a 2013, by the way. Motor don't look that bad, actually. With 260 on it. Coolant. I'm gonna open this because it's not cold. I'm gonna open this because it's not hot right now. Coolant look decent. Let me get to what the oil look like. I'm not checking the oil. I just wanna see what it look like. Everything smell good, smell decent. That thing moving in there, moving and shaking. This thing look all right, man. With 260 miles though, but <sighs> do got a check engine light code, but I still like the vehicle. I told y'all, she the newer model cars like this with two with the miles. Shit, I like them so. Yep, all the windows work, everything. So yeah, y'all let me know. What y'all think about it? Would y'all mess with something like this with 260,000 miles? If you want that scanner, make sure you look in the link in the description below. I'm going to uh, mess with this one a little bit more, see what we got, guys, and I'm going to get back with y'all in a minute, all right? All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, and I like the truck. I mean, the truck. I like the car. AC working, make sure. AC work. Um, this is definitely going to be one of the ones that I try to get along with the Malibu today with the 200 some thousand miles. Uh, no, Malibu got 171 on the miles. That got 200,000 miles. So next one, we got a uh, Josh Charger. Let's just see what's going on. Let's put the crank up. It's a little dirty in here though, but... Smell good, huh? Nah, you don't want this raggedy ass. Yeah. 230 miles on this one. This one raggedy though. So we're gonna keep walking. But that is definitely on my list. I want that. 260,000 miles. I love buying cars like that with the, you know, because the newer the car, the more miles, the cheaper I can get it. So I can get the body style. I got a lot of miles on the body style, but you know, I can still, you know, get the car. So um definitely looking forward to that guys definitely next up here we go right by each other perfect somebody want me to check out a car for them my homie i don't know where it's at all right but real quick we got this with the vertible top rain making in here and then we got that that four Toyota, Lara. I don't usually don't. Damn, what happened to the backs? I usually don't even mess with these because these kind of hold their value. But... The cranks right up. Everything cranking right up today. AC. Hold on. Turn that off right now. 
I see the little maintenance light on. I'm looking for the scanner so I can scan that joint. So, I don't know what it's Why Why the windows don't raise up though? That's not good. This thing gonna go for a lot of money. Uh, let's see what's going on here. Yeah, this motherfucker. This joint gonna go for a lot of money. I'm gonna drop the top on the haters, man. I done dropped the top on these haters, dog. Drop off the hood. I just don't know why the back windows won't raise up, but I actually like this. Vehicle. Hmm. Not so much, I guess. Well, it's a little oil right there. Y'all see the oil right there? There's some oil down there. I mean, it's nothing too bad. It's a valve cover, but as long as it ain't, might could just be good. Might could just be cleaned off. But it's an 07, y'all, with 228,000 miles on it. Mm, let me see what the current BA right now on it is. I can tell y'all right now whether I'm be interested in it or not. 50 bucks, so that ain't nothing right now. It's just $50. So, I don't know, though. Let's let this back up. But I gotta figure out why that... Oh, here you go. That ain't nothing wrong with this car. Oops, wrong way. Alright, so this is a good one. So I'm actually probably sit here and let this one relax and try to figure this out as well. Oh, but I'm digging this one. So we gonna see what it got. Mess with it, and I'll be back with y'all in a minute. Alright, while this do its thing, I'll check this thing out right here. Old school with 80,000 miles on this right here. Let's look at the body. The whole body. 219.93, 80,000 miles on it. Oh, here's my Chevy. I think that's my Chevy too. So I think they all right by each other. This is great. So this, I already looked at that. Is this it? Let me see. Yep, that's it. All right, so glad these three are right next to each other, y'all. So, ooh, can we get over there? We got the boots on. Clean. I don't see no power though. We about to try it. I think it's this one. Oh, stop putting y'all seatbelt like that and put y'all seatbelt on the correct way. Nope, no power. 58,000 miles on this one, 1993. Unfortunately, we don't got no power though. But we got this one right here. Oh, my car. Am I going to miss it? Damn, y'all. Talking to y'all. Talking to y'all. All right, we got this Jeep. Let me see. Hold up. Did I miss the car? I should be close. I don't think I should have missed it. No, hell no, I didn't. That a while ago. So we got this uh, Tahoe. I done ran into a spider web, y'all. Ran into a freaking spider web. So we got this Tahoe on the big mud wheels. Let's see what it looked like on the inside. Dirty, nasty, disgusting, and it stinks. Yeah, they didn't take care of this thing at all. So we're not gonna mess with that, y'all. So back over here to the Solara. So hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. Who texting me? I 
like it. Just gotta see what it sell for, man. These things hold they value, bro. They hold they value. So just gotta see what it sell for. What y'all think? Let me put this down. Got the heated seats. I like that it's a convertible. Oh, let me strap it back down. Is that fast supposed to be? That's not even like really down like that. There we go. Oh, there we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. All right. Move it up, back. y'all think about this one i think this one might be right boy oh my god something's in my eye it's saying break okay the brakes on Could go back up a little bit yeah i think this is gonna be a good one y'all so what i feel like that's how i feel about it so Y'all let me know in the comments below. I'm going to finish looking at it. And then I'm going to look at this truck my partner want. Um, but I think I'm done. And I looked at all my cars today. So be back with y'all in a second. All right, ladies and gentlemen. We got a 2018 Jeep Grand Cherokee truck off. Y'all won't believe how much money they got on this thing. With it looking like this. I'm going to show y'all all around the car real quick. But with it looking like this, right? Which is not super bad compared to that other one I had seen last time. Let's look at the motor and see. It says biohazard too, so somebody probably got hurt in this thing, blood or something like that. Oh, and the motor is tucking apart, by the way. So like, I'm not sure if y'all can see it, but the motor is actually like taking apart. This hood won't open, unfortunately, so I can't really show y'all what's going on for real, for real, but y'all can check it out though, the whole front end. Let me go this way. Glass, tires bent all up. Airbags all out. Damn, that door don't open. Can't open that door. Let's see if we can get in the back. Look, even the top of it. It's crazy. Dang. But it definitely says biohazard. That door might open, actually. This one opens, too. Damn. Oh, this is the one that's not going to open because of the plastic, so... I'm gonna just pull the camera in the front so y'all can see what's going on. Tow up from the flow up in it. It's hard to really get in there. But current bid on this thing is $5,000. Y'all let me know in the comments below what y'all think about that. $5,000. Do y'all think it's still worth $5,000? That's pre bid. So you don't know what it's really gonna sell for. But as of right now, is at five thousand dollars with it looking like this y'all let me know in the comments below do y'all think that's too much with the for the truck looking like this or y'all think it's cool for the 2018 uh track hawk so yeah y'all let me know what's up hustle nation this video has been sponsored to you by whdacademy.com the online course that's going to teach you everything you need to know about the auction game all my tips on how to properly inspect cars and most importantly how to make money as you can see i've been doing this for a while and as you can also see, I have plenty of testimonials on how I've helped others gain success in this business. So if you're interested in learning, be sure to click the link in the description below. All right, last but not least, we got a 2020 Dodge Charger Scat Pack wide body. I showed y'all this one before, but it's finally for sale. It got 8,000, 9,000 miles on it, 8,900 really. It's a theft and it got $20,325 on it as of right now. You can see the wheel is tilted a little bit right there. Like I said, I showed y'all this one before. It's been here for a minute, but <clears throat> show y'all again. The vehicle here is nice though. Twenty thousand. It looked like that's the only thing. The wheel over there. Like I say, I showed y'all this one before. It's been like a couple of months, but they finally got it for sale. It's been a minute since they had it. So we see the Jeep. What they we've seen what they had on a Jeep Trackhawk today, and we've seen what they got on one of these Challenger Scat Packs 392s. So y'all let me know what y'all think about it in the comments below. 
They might even have the key in the office, actually. Yeah, no key in here. So, yeah, guys. What do y'all think? Y'all let me know. It's got the suede and the leather. Um, Damn, I did not know it had little lights in there. So, that's cool. Uh, like I say, 8,000 miles, 9,000 miles. Pretty much a brand new truck. Uh, car, I mean. And, by the way, I did just win the Malibu Force. Sweet price, sweet, sweet, sweet price. Um, I don't know if they gonna give it to me. You know what I'm saying? It's on call. Y'all know how that get, how that is. That means that just because I want to bid at a certain number, they might want 500 more dollars. They might want a thousand more dollars. But if I can get it for what I just wanted for, that'll be sweet. But also in this video, um, I'm about to go see what's going on with the car that I'm trying to sell. Can't sell it. Some going on with the uh, the, the customer didn't pay. They um, uh, they, they they speed speeded through a school zone or some shit, and it's causing the, the transfer of the vehicle not to work. So, I'm kind of pissed off about that. The customer's still interested because he hit me up. Like, you know, what I'm saying, don't forget about me. But hopefully, we can get this resolved today. Um, because I want to sell the vehicle today, and I want to go pick up that other Malibu. So I'll see y'all on the next video. But I did win the Malibu. I won a 2013 Malibu or 171 on the miles. I don't know if I'm be giving them more money like that. <sighs> get off me. But uh, I appreciate y'all tuning in, man. Um, y'all let me know what y'all think about the price of this, $20,325. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the track hawk. And um, I'll see y'all on the next video, man. It's your boy Ray, Big Play Ray. Y'all wish me luck. Hopefully they tell me something good in here, man. Because I'm just ready to get rid of that other car, go get to my Malibu, and bid on these tomorrow. These two, the Solara and the uh, Taurus. So catch y'all on the next one, man. I'm out. Peace.